Meg Raw with rage. Patrick J. Adams joined with Max Beasley ruins her nasty acting career path. Meghan Markle and Patrick J. Adams actually met years before Suits began in 2011. In 2013, Markle explained to Marie Claire that the pair had worked together on a TV pilot for ABC in 2007. She went on to confess that their roles in this pilot were pretty similar to their roles in Suits. TV has always seen us in the same way, she explained. He's the rough around the edges guy, I'm the polished girl, and there's that, will they ever be together? Tension, she went on. It's pretty clear that the two actors have had amazing chemistry since the very beginning. In an interview with Larry King, Markle explained that their next meeting was during the Suits auditions. Apparently, the two actors fell into a firm friendship pretty quickly once they started working together again. Patrick J. Adams explained that their first job together was a little awkward as they didn't know each other. The next time, going into it, we realized we have to get to know each other and become friends very quickly, he went on to say. After forming their initial bond due to their similar ages and acting experience, Meghan Markle and Patrick J. Adams continued to get closer, eventually becoming the very best of friends. To mark the Suits series finale in 2019, Adams posted a series of adorable throwback photos of him and his castmates on set. In several photos, Markle was seen lounging on various set pieces, clearly perfectly at ease, and having a great time working with her friend and co-star. In another series of photos, she was shown having drinks with Adams and her other Suits castmates and wandering through the streets of Toronto under an umbrella. If Adams' candid shots weren't enough proof of their super-close relationship, the bloopers from Suits really do show just how well the pair got on, in fact, judging by the hiccups, Markle and Adams seemed to struggle to get through most of their scenes without making each other cackle with laughter. Patrick A. Adams and his then-girlfriend Pretty Little Liars actress Troyan Belisario announced their engagement in 2014. In 2016, they tied the knot in a beautiful woodland wedding. Unfortunately, Adams' longtime friend and co-worker Meghan Markle didn't attend. Markle was invited to the wedding but decided to stay home in Toronto. A source explained that she and Adams both kind of agreed that maybe her coming would attract too much, of the wrong kind of, attention. The source added, they both thought it sucked. In other news, Meghan Markle once called British actor Max Beasley a stud, a string of Twitter messages has shown. The American actress, who is in a relationship with Prince Harry, met the Mad Dogs star on the set of slick legal drama Suits back in 2013. And it seems the pair got on like a house on fire, as the two enjoyed a fun exchange online. After the 45-year-old hunk shared an old shot of himself in a suit, Meghan flirtatiously replied, stud. When Meghan later shared a photo of a bouquet of flowers, Max quipped, they are my fave too. Glad you got them. I was worried they would mess the order. While it's been three years since Max appeared on the show, the heartthrob appears to have kept in touch with the Fringe star. According to the Daily Star, Max sent the following message to the actress just a few weeks ago, sent you an email by mistake, babe, it's for another M. No idea how that happened. Sending love X. Max has been involved in a string of high-profile relationships, having previously dated the likes of Mel B and Jody Marsh. The star has since settled down and married American dancer Jennifer Beasley, with whom he shares daughter Sabrina Beasley.